All right, and welcome back. First off, <gasps> blue hair. I love it so much. Oh my gosh, you guys. It's great. Sorry, it's really late in the day. All right, like 7.45, whatever. It's dark. <laughs> so, I got really bad lighting right now. But I'm here because I'm so excited. Okay, so I got a lottery stand. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. In violet. Okay, okay, so we are gonna open it because I'm so excited. Don't kill me for what I'm about to do. I have no scissors up here that are non-crafting, guys. So the ones I can actually like sharpen are the ones I'm gonna use. Okay, I'm so bad, I'm sorry. So, I, oh. I'll talk. I got this from Fire Poppies in South Carolina. Amazing, amazing customer service from them. So I posted Monday, Sunday, Monday, maybe the weekend. So sometime I posted on my Instagram, I was looking into a lottery. I think that's how you say it. Aw, that's so cute. Um, and someone had recommended them and tagged them on Instagram. They immediately commented back and uh, so I called her and it was great. Great customer service. Um, shipped super quick. Um, reading, not showing my address to you because yeah. So this shipped Tuesday to my house by Thursday. Like, it was incredible. Oh! Okay, okay. First off, came with a business card. It says Fire Poppies. I hope you love this as much as I love putting it together for you. Fire Poppies Stitchery. Then I have my packing slip, which they put a Charleston Chew vanilla in there. Ah, oh, that's adorable one of one yes I ordered the second today's the sixth and I've had it a day so um, and I wanted one that was colored I, I swear I say this like every video I like color guys color I like it um, so I wanted to get uh, one of the colored ones Sorry, I keep knocking my cord, because that's going to be loud. Okay, oh. oh. so inside, we got soon is the base instructions, which I might look at. And then I have my violet. Oh my gosh, this is so cool. Okay, let's read. Okay, okay. Okay. Okay, all right, let's figure this out. Oh my word. I'm not dramatic. Nope. I love this color. Okay, we're gonna have to read because there's a little couple of stuffs. <sighs> this is an aggressive Allen wrench, guys. Okay. Okay. Clamp. Um, I am planning on getting a tablet holder for like musicians um, to hold both my iPad and my Kindle. 
I usually use my iPad to stitch. Um, it's an iPad mini. Um, but then whatever I can in Pattern Keeper, I do in Pattern Keeper because Pattern Keeper is amazing. Um, so I actually have two tablets. I think they're both downstairs right now. Uh, yeah, they're in my purse. Because who doesn't carry stitching in their purse, right? Please tell me I'm not the only one. Okay. Um, I went with the Lowry because it was readily available. And I like how small it is compared to a lot of the other frames. Um, I didn't realize, oh my gosh, this is purple too. Ugh. Okay, it's well packaged, guys. difficult because it's like three pieces. Uh, okay. 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 Wait. Okay. So, wait a minute. Not a user error, guys. Found it. I'm a dip. So, in case you want to be a dip like me, you guys, the screws attach. Been a long day. Great day. All I did was get my hair done and get my favorite food. But it's been a long day. Like, a super long day. So. I know. It's also purple. Okay. So. Alright. I need to go like this. Then this, 
let you rotate. So I'm gonna say probably like this. Then, keep a gram guard on here to protect my stitching and such. And then, oh my. Oh my gosh, this is so cool. Okay, hang on. Well, I will take pictures of a set up, but I love this so much, you guys. Hang on. Welcome to my mess of a room. Sorry. But here is my stand. Uh, the base fits nicely underneath my chair. So then, let me just scoochie. So here I'm going to put a tablet holder. That should fit both my tablets. Then I have this perfectly to just stitch and go. This is exciting. All right, so I thought we'd talk about this for a second while I get things going. Um, so I actually got this because Middle Earth is massive. We've been over this plenty of times. Um, and with it being so big, um, I just, it's too heavy for me to hold um, comfortably. And so all I was doing, let's see if we can learn how to do this, guys. Um, stitch two-handed. Um, oh, this is awkward. Oh dear. Ooh. I would think I would know how to cross stitch. But, um, so it's just too heavy to hold comfortably. And so I decided I wanted a stand, and this seemed like the best scenario for me. I love it. Um, it's a bit more expensive than I wanted to. Um, it came out to just over 200, like 203, including shipping. But I'm, I really like it so far. I love the color, and I think it's going to be a great stand, and it's a good investment for me in general. I'm only 30. Um, and so I have plenty of years to go, especially with Middle Earth. So I'm super excited. I love this and I think this is going to be a great addition to my stitchy cave. So thank you very much. Uh, thank you for watching. Um, I'm going to try to do some interesting ed edits on this one. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. But. I am so excited. I cannot wait to see how this works for me. And yeah, so thank you very much. And I hope you have a wonderful, colorful day.